Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we've got another 911, however this is a Gen 1. So it's a 64 plate and look how it is for the age. It's probably in better condition than my car. Well, I really like them alloys by the way, Simon. So this is Simon's car. He's going to take me out for the day, do some little flybys, down some big roads, country roads and yeah we'll just basically see how this differs compared to the 991.2 so as you all know from the previous video of a 911 that was jamie's so that was running es 750 however this one's running es 800 so that's about 800 at the wheel however that will be about 900 brake so usually at events he does actually run this on um, race fuel but today we're on pump so before we go out on a drive the eagle eye viewers of the channel may have noticed this one's actually missing a roof so this is the convertible 911 and actually it weighs a lot more about 90 kilos but yeah i'll just run through all the other specifications for you now and the color of this paint is absolutely unreal it's like a royal blue with a nice pearlescent fleck in it so the colour is actually called sapphire blue, it goes really nice with the yellow calipers and the yellow ES on the ES motor sticker. So yeah, really good combo, nice one. So moving around to the wheels, like I said before, I actually really do like these, especially with like the paint, the diamond cut, it all just blends really nice together. So these are a factory option that come on the car and as you can see they've got really big brakes, so we've got six pots on the front and we've got four pots on the back and Simon's also got our triple eight R's on the back haven't you? Yep. Yeah. And then moving around to the back of the car from standard it's got active aero so it comes with the spoiler and the front lip so basically the spoiler will tilt once you're going past a certain speed and obviously when you're braking it will tilt up for the downforce as well so it's basically race car shit. And like I've just mentioned with the back spoiler the splitter will actually deploy as well so yeah it's pretty cool to be honest so enough of the specifications let's get into the video and let's see how the car is Yeah. I think if even on downshifts and stuff like that, 
day, yeah. We um, I ran the fastest time, which was a 9.91. Thanks for bringing your insane 
9-11. No, listen, thanks for having me. I've no had worries. a really good day. It's been, uh, it's been really good. It's been eventful. Yeah. And I'm sure you guys think this video has been eventful because my jaw here. So I don't know about yours. <laughs> You've got to be careful what you say. Well, no, I mean, from laughing. Viewers might get the wrong end of the stick there, mate. So guys, if you have liked the video, then please give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you want to see next in the comments. Maybe you've got a car for me to review or something along them lines. Simon, how do you fancy getting your 570 on the channel? Yeah, I think that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, so if you want to see more of Simon, let me know in the comments as well. I'm sure people will. <laughs> but yeah, please like, comment, subscribe for more from me. And we maybe we'll see you again, but I'll definitely see you in the next video. Bye.